norepinephrine dopamine reuptake inhibitors ndris bupropion its mechanism of action remains controversial among some experts leading hypothesis being it inhibits the reuptake of both dat and net interestingly pet scans suggest that no more than 20 to 30% and perhaps as little as 10 to 15% of striatal dats may be occupied at therapeutic dosage of bupropion and the net occupancy is expected to be in the same range it is metabolized to a number of active metabolites some of which are more potent the most potent of these is the positive enantiomer of the 6 hydroxy metabolite it is also known as rifaxin it has a rapid short acting and a high degree of dat occupancy which is characteristic of abusable stimulants such as cocaine but bupropion has just enough dat inhibition with slow enough onset and long enough duration of action to make it an antidepressant it has proven effective in treating nicotine addiction and is consistent with the possibility that it is occupying dads in the striatum and nucleus accumbens in a manner sufficient to mitigate craving but not sufficient to cause abuse and appears especially useful in targeting the symptoms of reduced positive effect within the affective spectrum such as loss of happiness joy interest pleasure energy enthusiasm alertness and self confidence originally marketed in the US as an immediate release formulation with thrice a day administration development of a twice a day formulation that is sr and more recently once a day formulation that is xl has not only reduced the frequency of seizures at peak plasma drug levels but has also increased convenience and enhanced compliance as well interestingly it does not appear to cause the bothersome sexual dysfunction that frequently occurs with antidepressants that act on certain inhibition probably because it lacks a significant serotonergic component to its mechanism of action symptoms of dopamine deficiency syndrome and reduced positive effect frequently benefits from switching to bupropion or augmenting SSRI or SNRI treatment with it.